Am I on? Hi guys. Um, happy Tuesday. So we are testing the new grill mat tonight. We've never tried it before. Wanted to share it with you guys. Um, it's super beautiful out. We got everything over here. I don't know if you want to see the spread, but um, Tilly's venturing around here too. But anyway, so we have chicken on the grill already. This is the grill mat. Um, over here, Tilly, come. You get this black mat, which has a little um, of our sauce on it already, but then you get this steel frame too, which you set right on top of the grill. Um, we're gonna do that. And I wanted to find like smaller stuff that, um, you know, easily falls through your grill grates and um, can also fall through like the holes in your grill baskets too, which we love our grill baskets. Um, but we wanted to see what we could do with this. So um, this thing, both of them, is oven, or not even oven, is heat safe to 500 degrees. I'm literally gonna put it right on here and I am like nervous this is gonna melt because it just seems like it would, but um, we're gonna test it out. So we've got that on the grill. Um, we preheated the entire grill and then literally like two minutes ago, I just, oops, there went pepper down. Um, I just shut off this side so that it's not on direct heat because it is not safe to be on direct heat. This side is still on. Um, overall, it is heat safe to 500 degrees. Tilly, come. And Tilly's out venturing around. Good girl, come here. No more, no more pig ears. We have little milk, not even milk bones. I don't know if they're at. Yes, good girl. So let's take a look at this. This thing is going to be super amazing because, again, for like sauces and glazes, none of it is going to like drip off of what you're making. So you can add whatever you want in here. I just threw on some olive oil. We got chopped onions, more peppers, jalapenos. And then we're kind of doing, I don't even know, what would you consider it? Like a Tex-Mex style. So I did like a hot sauce mixture. And... What else is in here? Hot sauce and salsa verde, you guys. So I'm just gonna dump it on a little bit. Um, this thing is supposed to allow you to still see the grill marks on your food if you have it um, hot enough. So we're gonna let this cook a little bit, stir it up a little bit, let it go, see what happens. Um, if I didn't mention this already, it's supposed to hold up to four and a half pounds of food. And then you can literally just pick the whole thing up with the steel there. Ooh, those are ready to flip too. Awesome. So we're going to see what happens here, you guys. Is anybody on? Casey, Amy, Amy, and Tammy. Casey, Amy, and Tammy. Hi, ladies. Sorry my photographer never lets me know that you guys are here, but look at that chicken. This looks delicious too. Um, I'm just going to keep an eye on the grill to make sure it stays under 500 degrees now. We've got a couple flare-ups, but that's okay. We like the char. So I can already see some bubbling action happening on this grill mat too, which is cool. So we definitely want those to cook. We'll see if we get the actual grill marks on them too. Who else is here? Hi, you guys. Hey, Casey. Whoop, whoop. So anyway, you guys, so that's a new grill mat. Um, I'm super excited to test it out again like whatever sauces and glazes you would want to make. You can cook it all right on the grill. You don't have to worry about flare ups or anything else like falling off. Um, so yeah, I'm super excited. I'll take some pictures and show you guys what this looks like afterwards. Oh, I probably shouldn't touch that, it's gonna get hot. But <laughs> anyway, the only other thing to keep in mind with that. Mare's online. Hey, Mayor. She said, well, we have both tongs. She said, what's what's with the shorts? Aren't you cold or? Dang, I'm like ready to take not my 15 sweatshirt degrees there, off right now. Mark? It was like 84 here today. Yeah. It was great. Um, we have our regular tongs for our chicken and then um, you're not supposed to use steel utensils on that grill mat. So that's why I have my other tongs with me. So anyway, that's what we wanted to show you guys. We'll post updates and share with you later. Hope you all can be grilling soon. Bye.